Hello everybody, it is Cat9453 here, and we are back with another video of Back to the Future Episode 1. Uh, sorry for the burping, I just had a sprite earlier from packing its stuff. Uh, Last time we were here, I think we were no trying way to get- I'm gonna keep that door open without some help. Last time we were here, we are trying to get the alcohol, I believe, so- Emmett! I need you to keep the door open. Huddle up, Emmett. Huddle? Just come Just here. Listen up for a second. I need you to, to get the door. Damn it, I can't get into Open. the door over there. Those tables are jamming it shut. The door? So your plan is to just waltz in there and take a barrel of alcohol? Yep. Uh, no, uh, of course not. That would be stupid, right? I'll say. Stupid is my middle Still, name, I'd though. Like to get that door open. <laughs> I can't do anything from out here. <laughs> well, it's a simple matter of physics. A lever, some sort of stop. Let me see what I can come up with. It's not really, but you get the point, guys. Um, guess you can do that. I guess I have to distract him somehow in order to get the barrels to come down. Um, Eureka! Cool. Got the doors there. Guess I just had to unlock that part. Um, hey, uh, can I get it some uh, soup? Excuse me. Yeah. Can I have a bowl of soup? You're a soup kitchen. What do you think? I thought you were a soup kitchen where you pretty much don't make soup and you clean the bowls of the people who eat the soup. Yeah. I don't know. That or mayonnaise is an instrument. I have no idea. Uh, what kind of soup is this? It, it tastes like... Scrolle Ribolita? Not even close, that buddy. That week old cabbage. Yeah. Everyone's a critic. Look, all I got to work with is this two-bit soup in a barrel and spice rack that hadn't been restocked since the Coolidge administration. What do you think I should do to perk this slop up? Uh, Let's see. Have you tried? Uh, salt's bad. Color. Give it a kick? Chili powder? Giving the soup a little heat, maybe? Why, is it getting cold? No, 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 no. no. I mean, like chili powder. Muy caliente. Oh, bit of a tough guy, huh? Actually, I like it spicy too, but it's gotta be edible for the common folks. <laughs> Come on, a little dash isn't gonna kill anyone. Aw, oh, heck. You got moxie, kid. Let's spice it up a bit, shall we? Sure. Nice, now I can go and have distracted him, so... Uh. Three knocks. Um. Nope. Okay. One, two, three! Yes! Now I gotta get the barrel somehow. Okay. I can do... Miss Strickland, come for some more soup? How does she have to ruin come everything? On, Mr. You know I wouldn't set one foot in this mockery of all that is good and decent if the poor of Hill Valley weren't so dependent on Mr. Tennant's overblown show of generosity. Was that a yes? Just give me the soup before I gag on the hypocrisy. Why does she have to ruin everything? Now she's got the alcohol or the huge. I'll tell the boss you said hello. Oh, joy. I'll just bet you will. I gotta convince her somehow to give it to me. And they picked up the barrel of hooch. Now all I have to do is to get it from her somehow. Away to Edna, the cranky older, in this case, young, crazy old bat lady. Young bat lady, whatever. Get the point. Okay. Bada bing, bada boom. Talk to Edna about this. Edna! 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 Nice spike. Huffy? Huffy? I'm not Huffy. I'm passionate. Passionate about justice, safety, law, and order. Uh, never mind. That was the name of the bike brand, but okay, I hey, guess uh, it Mr. doesn't Strickland. exist yet. Oh, hello, Mr. Corleone. Try not Man. to draw any undue attention my way. I'm on the trail of a hot new scoop, as we in the newspaper business say. She goes from, like, 100 to zero in, like, two seconds. Uh, two seconds. What's the scoop? What's the scoop? I've heard rumors that something shady is going on at the Sisters of Mercy soup kitchen. No, really? Laundry, you know. 
And oh, we mustn't jump to any conclusions. Not till the facts are in. I hope to heaven it is just a rumor. That soup kitchen is the front line of the good fight. If it goes bad, what will happen to the Stay Sober Society? Not to mention all the charitable institutions that depend on me for soup deliveries. To admit, I do like her and appreciate her for being a reporter that actually goes after for the truth and waits till all the facts are in. Anyway, uh, what's the Stay Sober Society? What's the Stay Sober Society? You haven't heard of the SSS? They nope. do the most marvelous work, taking hopeless drunken bums and turning them into former hopeless drunken bums. I'm one of the founding members. And not to say that I was ever, oh well, you know. Anyway, sure. I always met in the cellar of the Sisters of Mercy soup kitchen, but for some reason the new managers don't want us down there, so we're stuck. We've got nowhere to meet. Uh, oh god, Emmett is going to kill me. I know where the Stay Sober Society can meet. Stay Sober Society can meet. Oh. Where? Brown residence. The Brown residence. You mean Judge Brown's place? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I happen to be good friends with his son Emmett, and he's told me the judge would love to lend his place up for, you know, good causes like yours. Really? Why, that's the most generous, public-spirited offer I've received in a month of Sundays. I hate Please lying. Please tell your friend Emmett we accept. And the offer couldn't have come at a better moment. It's almost time for the meeting to begin. I hate lying so much. I got a book. Oh? Where? Uh, not in your beeswax. Okay, okay, now I gotta get the- Now I gotta find my grandpa, so... Dog plus hat. Get the hat. I need to get the hat. Okay. Hopefully I don't die somehow. I mean, I'm eventually gonna get killed by him, but... Oh, matches. You, you got kiwi all over my socks! Sorry, boss. Get out of here. How about you? Huh? I'm sitting at a shoe shine booth. You walk up. Either you're here to shine my shoes, or you got a death wish. Which is it? The death wish. Um, <laughs> no. Um, I guess I'm here to shine your shoes. I'm looking for Arthur I'm looking McFly. for a guy named Arthur McFly. He's my, uh, sort of a relative. Well, he's my employee. He's very busy today. Well, do you know when I might find him? And isn't that- wait, isn't that Artie's hat? Isn't that Arthur McFly's hat you're holding? It was McFly's hat. Now, it's my peanut bowl. <laughs> Can I have one of them? I'm going to die. Can I'm some so, peanuts? so going to die. Why not? So I'm a going... magnanimous kind of guy. So Go going ahead. to get- Knock yourself out. So going to get myself killed here. Um, what's that? Hey, kid! Yeah? What's that? And they can't jump can over? Are they that dumb? Oh, oh. <clears throat> Apparently they are. Damn it! Give me that hat, you lousy crow. Catch! Damn it! Physics, buddy, you can do it. You can do it. Do it, you can do it, you can do it. Physics. Onto the bus! Nobody makes a monkey out of Kid Tannen! Well, I just did! And he just stepped in. Well, I hope that's mud. I got clean your shoes Ow, again! Fix me up! In your face. Okay. Can do this. Where'd you learn how to move like that? Sandlot football. They used to call me the streak. Get out. Nice. Okay, well I guess we are going to find my grandpa now. And there was a glitch here, I think. So I don't know. Telltale? Do something about that, I hope. Okay. Yeah. Hey boy! I need you to find my grandpa right now. I said no, not Emmett. I say. There we go. There you go, boy. There you go. Hey, honey. Come here for a sec, boy. Hey, boy. Can you find the guy who belongs to this hat? <gasps> yes! Follow the leader! Only one way to find out. To find my grandfather. Yo, oh, hi, Emmett. <laughs> oh, that would have been hilarious if I could actually, like, you know, like, 
voice things in the game while that happened. Oh, that would have been hilarious to say. Oh, Emmett. What do you mean, Emmett? Oh, that Emmett. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> deja vu. A really big deja vu. Really big deja vu. So I gotta buzz in. Yeah? Who is it? It's McFly! Shh, I know! Uh... Hey, Hi, Arthur. Arthur! Can you come down a minute? Do I know you? Yeah, um, uh, I- we're family! I'm your grand... uh, mother's great nephew. You mean my second cousin? Yeah! yeah. Glad to know you, but I can't leave this building till the boss says so. He's given strict orders. Sorry. Some other time. Do I seriously have to- oh no. To the recorder! Again! I'm gonna get myself killed again. I just know it. I just completely know it, people. Come on, Einstein! <sighs> he's not there. Well, he's there now. Well, I'm totally going to die, but if it means saving Doc, I guess it's worth it? Maybe? I don't know, because technically if Art if he dies, then the whole continuing of him building the machine and everything would have never happened. Y you get the point. Okay. Just gotta get his voice somehow without being discovered or getting killed. Somehow. I don't know how, but somehow I I'll figure it out. Okay. Nope. Oh, went too far. I went too far! I went too far! Oh well, well, look who's back! They say rats always return to the scene of the sinking ship. Uh, Hi. Matches. His name is Matches? Really? It's because he's like, you know, skinny like a twig or a, a match, a match stick? Anyway. Okay, okay, that's not gonna work, that's not gonna work. Okay, I really just trapped myself, didn't I? How did he not get me from that distance? Like, really? I did not get to climb. Gotcha now. Down from there. Nope. What do you think you're doing up there, you scrawny little runt? Get down here right now! That's all I need. Don't okay. make me angry, Smucko! Hey, Get Einstein! And... Stick him! Einstein! Help! Ah. Lay off! Get away from me, you crazy butt! Go, go away! Incognito assassin tree is going stand. away. Get my grandpa. Okay. Uh, to go, not to Edna, but to my grandpa. I'm not gonna even look at the. Which, by the way, kids, if you ever are crossing the street, look both ways and don't be like Marty here, who's pretty much dumb and is just gonna cross the street anyway in hopes of getting killed by a car. Okay. Now I just gotta buzz him again. Bushki? And... What now? Kaboom. What do you think you're doing up there, you scrawny little runt? Get down here right now! It's kid! Right away, boss! I hate lying to people so much. I'm doing uh, so much lying in this game. Where's kid? Yeah, uh, he didn't exist. It was a tape recorder. Um, just gonna tell you right now. I'm sorry. He's been subpoenaed. Arthur McFly? Yeah? Got something for you. Thanks. A subpoena? Ordering you to appear in court and provide evidence in the investigation into- Kid Tannen? Take it back! You can't get rid of it, Mr. McFly. Once you've been served, it's your duty to report to the court at the earliest possible time. Failure to do so could lead to a warrant for your arrest. Arrest? <laughs> the kid'll kill me. Stupid, stupid Artie. Holy cats, what am I gonna do? I suggest you avail yourself to the protection of the court. Oh gosh, oh I just, gosh. I guess it is right now. There wasn't much protection back then, so I wouldn't. Actually, I would have ran. Nah, I'm kidding. I would have actually gone to the court. <sighs> 
Mm -hmm. Oh, I hate doing stuff like that. But I won't have to much longer. No? Once we get that 190 proof alcohol and build my rocket drill, my future will be set and I'll be able to quit this crummy job. Oh, yeah. Right. About that. Um, yeah, I guess. I guess we gotta go. To, um, stuff. Yeah. Um, hey, Emmett? Uh. Yeah, that's not what okay. What are you? I already did. I'll keep cogitating. And ask her if the, is the meeting time now? Meeting? Hey, uh, Edna. Hey, uh, Miss Strickland. Oh, hello, Mr. Corleone. I'm afraid I haven't much time. The meeting of the Stay Sober Society is due to begin very soon. But can you go then? I got a book. Uh, what do I do? I'm. I don't want to use the hint, but I'm kind of stuck here, people, and I really don't know what I gotta do now. So. Help? If you volunteer to help Edna, she might be able to help you. Didn't think of that. Maybe I can help her with the Stay Sober Society? Oh jeez, Louise, I am really hey, a Mr. horrible Flynn. person in this game. Hello, Mr. Corleone. I'm afraid I haven't much time. The meeting of the Stay Sober Society is due to begin very soon. Oh... Uh, do you make soup deliveries? I make hot soup deliveries. It's one of my many small contributions to the good cause. Healthy bodies, healthy souls. Or so one hopes. I pick up barrels of hot soup at the kitchen, and I deliver them hither and thither. Hill Valley Orphanage, the St. Francis Xavier Ranch oh, for Unwanted this Children, not a good Bobby idea, Mountain Home for the Incurably Insane, Shady Acres Rest that. Home. Oh, I can barely keep track of them all. It's a very big job. Uh, I can help deliver the I soup. I can help you deliver soup. But I donate a lot of time to charities. Oh, which ones? The, um, Mario Brothers. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. The Italians I'm do so many good works. I'm gonna do so many good works. If you fix it not so you. I can pick up the barrel Can't do Luigi's soup. voice. Now hold your horses, let's not get over eager. I drive the soup cycle in this town, and I'm not about to turn it over to an upstart. But, if you're well connected with the local charitable institutions... Yeah? You can let me know when they're running low on soup. Well, the, uh, State Sober Society? Uh, I know a charity that... Needs As a matter deliver? of fact, I do know a local charity that's running low on soup. Oh, who? The Stay Sober Society! The Stay Sober Society? That's right! They'll soon be gathering at the Brown Estate, and we haven't provided refreshments. I can't get over the generosity of your friend Emmett, volunteering his father's house for our meeting. Huh? Wait there! Michael! What in the name of Thomas Alva Edison do you think you're doing? Yeah, Don't you Edison. get it? You need alcohol to run your drill, right? Those bootleggers at the soup kitchen won't let us get our hands on any of their hooch. But we can get Miss Strickland to pick it up for us and deliver it right to your door. No, out of the question. Why? I can't just let strangers invade my parents' house. What do we know about these people? They're well behaved. They're sober? They're sober. It says so right in the name. Well, okay, but a pop needs his peace and quiet at the end of the day. This meeting is sure to be too noisy for him. No, 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 no. They'll, they'll, they'll be quiet. Be quiet? If not, they'll he be can quiet, be deaf. Right? Oh, yes! I play my tambourine very softly. Did not you hear that? that? Yes, but... But what? But it's still impossible. How is it impossible? I promise, Miss Strickland. I promise, Miss Strickland. It means so much to her. She's crazy. Answer still no. Dude, think of the Stay Sober think Society. The Stay Sober Society. What'll happen to them? They can all fall off the wagon for all I care. Aren't you selfish then? Okay, forget the whole thing. We don't have to test your rocket power drill tonight. We don't? No. no. I'll take the train back to Washington and I'll tell the folks at the office to give the patent to Dr. McCoy. Wait. <laughs> I still can't get over the fact it's Leonard McCoy. Is the doc. I love that. You will instruct the members of the society to wipe their feet before they come inside. Then you are, Emmett Brown. I thought as much. You have such a righteous face. Oh, no. Edna Strickland, I don't know how to thank you for your generosity. Oh, um, uh, pleased to meet you. Oh, no. The feeling is mutual. 
No. No, 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 no. Keep those two away from I've each other. I've got a bad feeling about this. I've got a bad feeling about it too. Keep those too two much, away from each other. I do not well, need crazy old bat lady be married to him. Delivered to your house. Looks like we're off to your lab to build your rocket drill. Ah, uh, you do have a lab, right? What kind of future patent holder would I be without a lab? Come on. Labs in the garage, I guess. Okay. Doc. We're going there. I'm off to get the rocket drill. Good. <gasps> Come on, let's go. Time waits for no man. Got it. Bye, dog. Are you sure this is gonna work? Damn it. Don't let the ramshackle nature of my laboratory fool you. If all goes according to plan, we'll soon be in possession of the most powerful rocket fuel known to man. That's great. Uh, how? Well, it's very simple. This crankshaft induces a powerful direct current into the electrolysis chamber, producing hydrogen, which must be periodically released into the primary distillation barrel. Okay. While tending to the hydrogen, we'll also need to regularly sprinkle these shredded protein flakes into this aquarium of tuber bacteria to generate the necessary nitrogen to catalyze the reaction. Okay. Cool. Oh, hot! Extremely hot! The temperature of the reaction must be kept at a steady temperature of 623 degrees Kelvin by carefully pumping these bellows! Cool. Any questions? Uh... Yeah, no, no, no I got nothing. Uh, is there gonna be a test on this? Or could... I mean, I under... I actually understood him. So, I'm just gonna ask him. Uh... Hey, Matt? Oh, no. Why is there a brace of drunkards gathering on our lawn? Sweet fancy Moses, it's my father! So? So, he doesn't know I'm engaging in acts of scientific exploration in here. He thinks this is where I go to pour through my law books. Oh. You turn to the reaction, I'll try to get rid of him! Okay, um, uh, I can't what? really do can that right now, because... It's too late! I the reaction's really... already started! Don't worry, I'll try to help you out where I can. But... I don't think uh, you understand. Coming, father! Emmett! Father! Don't... I really can't do that, and the reason why is because I gotta go. <laughs> I can't save right now. Are you Don't serious? You father me, child. I don't know what's eating you, father, but I wish it would go on a diet. <laughs> you don't know what's going on. Can I save now? Can I? Can I save now? Can I save now? Yes, I want to overwrite this data. Well, let's go with that and overwrite the data. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Okay. So, everybody? This is me, Cat9453 here, and I gotta go by, you guys. Because, like I said, I was kind of in a rush. I had to go. This episode's kind of running long. Sorry. If you guys have an account, like, subscribe, comment. If not, either way, thanks for watching. I gotta go. This episode's running long, and I gotta help my dad now. So, yeah. Bye!